Hello, I'm uh, Dr. Kyle Eberlein, and I'm representing Catholic Brothers for Christ. And I just want to talk to you about uh, why you should come to the men's conference that we have every year and what it can do for you. Because if you were like me, at one time I was just a, a Sunday only Catholic, and I, I tended to, um, you know, I just went to Mass basically, and my family would go, but that's about all I did. I recognized over time that, that you know, I really wasn't uh, totally satisfied with the way our culture is going here. And, um, and I'd always hear the, uh, the words in the background, well, somebody else will take care of it. Somebody, somebody else can handle that, things of that nature. And what I came to realize by going to conferences like this and associating with Catholic men and having a Christian community is really, um, it takes just uh, a little bit of each one of us to make a difference. And what I'm talking about in essence is, how do you become, how do you make a difference in our culture? And how you do that is becoming the spiritual leader of your household. And really, you know, that's what God is asking to do. He's asking to be a spiritual leader of your household. Because if you can take charge of, of your household and spirituality and not let your wife be the one that always makes the decisions and has to run the household. If you can be the, the person to be the example to your kids, then what happens is that those around you see what you're doing and they will start questioning you and they will, they will, still, uh, they will want to start being around you. And then from there, your spiritual leadership develops and then all those things around you change and your life gets better, you get your vertical alignment correct, uh, you get God first in your life, your spouse is, is next, then your, your family, then work, and then your community. And then when all those things just line up how God wants them to be, then good things happen. And um, so becoming a spiritual leader is critical, but, it, but it's, not, it's not hard. It's just a matter of being a participant actually in your family, actually leading your family in prayer first, and then just being an example and be willing to talk to it with your, with your family and your kids. And what you'll see is when you start doing that is all those things around you start changing. Changing at your home, changing at the work, changing people at, at, uh, at the church and wherever you're at. And so I mention this is because Catholic Brothers for Christ, that's one of our objectives, that's one of our mission statements is how do we change men and how do we help men become the spiritual leaders of their households? And I can tell you that just starting to go to conferences and our Expiritus Renewal in the fall, when you, when you start attending events like that, it gets you into that Christian community that lifts you up and helps you stay focused with the power of the Holy Spirit, the Bible, the prayer, and the things that we all need to do on a daily basis. And, and you will see your life change, and you'll see those around you change, and together we'll see our culture change.